Okay. 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 <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay. yeah. Watch out the car. Watch out the car. Yeah. Hold on, I got. You got starting issues. I got issues. Look how Ryan makes that KTM 650 look so small. <laughs> So what do you say, Kurt, we go uh, ride a little pit bike track? Hey, that sounds like a good idea. Let's do it. Creepy parent will stop. <laughs> Ooh, I put my visor down. I, I go in incognito. Talk about. Let uh, well, let us talk about the mother of all brap. The mother of all braps. Oh yeah, you know what that is, don't you? Well, let's take a left. Okay. The mother of all braps is the trip that Mendo and I took with Ryan and Ben. This in this RV right here, 1,000 miles from Oregon through Idaho to all the way down to southeast Utah to ride the beautiful desert lands of Moab. It was the mother of all braps. It certainly was. Yes, and uh, with my big arts and crafts bag that I had with me at all times, I recorded a lot of epic scenery. Hopefully I'll, I'll show that in a couple months when I make the big video movie. Um, and. Uh, it was, it wasn't as spiritual for you as it was for me, bro. It was. It was, it was a super spiritual, oh, all these weeds. Super I mean, spiritual experience. And uh, I, I'm definitely a lot more enlightened as a person and human being just for going down there and doing that, you know what I mean? It's, yeah, Moab okay. is, Balls. it's kind of a power center down there. Yeah. It's too bad all the people that live there look like they're from species and they're like, oh. I hate this place! <laughs> 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 uh, I'm not gonna do that. Are you kidding me? I'm not gonna do that. Look. <laughs> See, it's just gonna go straight. You gotta pop the wheelie. <laughs> oh, I can just. Oh, I'm teetering on the edge. <laughs> Oh, it's got four inch tires. I know, it's like a it's so four inch. <laughs> I just dug a big hole inside of your yard. That's cool. It's it's got holes. So yeah, Moab was uh, Moab was pretty amazing and I think uh, not only the place they made it amazing, but also the people really on this trip. Yeah. Our, uh, little, our little dual sport crew is a pretty amazing group of people. These guys, like, and a couple, and not all guys, gotta remember, gotta remember Miss Stace. But just, uh, just a really generous uh, teamwork. Um, just people I would consider almost, uh, yeah, very, definitely close friends now. Even family, I yeah, would that's dare what I say. say. Even family, yeah. It was also super hilarious. Everybody was just a clown. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we're, all kind of, we're all kind of the same nerd. Yeah. <laughs> oh, would you look at this pit bike track? Ooh. Would you just look at it? It's just so cute. Would you just look at this pit bike track? <laughs> I smell too strong desire. So yeah, awesome journey. We faced adversity. We had broken bikes. We had crashes. Oh my god. People getting lost all over the place. Yeah. We got Ben and Mendo out in, the, out in the middle of Moab on the first night with basically nothing. I know, right? Lucky they had cell phone service and were able to get a hold of us. Yeah. We had on the way back, we had a tire go out, rolling down the highway with sparks flying out the rear. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that was 
was amazing that nobody died. <laughs> yeah. yeah, the changing it was its own experience too. Oh, and I got all of it on video, guys. It's gonna come soon. My, my visor's fogging up, I can't see. Whee! Oh. Yeah, so Ryan, like, this is... This pig track is so fun. I don't want to take it too hard because the pigs are loose. <laughs> and I don't want to die. Just cruise it. <laughs> That's why you just cruise it. Whoa. Oh, little bit of squirrely. Little bit of squirrely. Oh, I love, I love this pit bike track, bro. Oh, yeah, it's pretty, oh. it's pretty killer. My, uh, my buddies that designed it did a pretty good job. I'm pretty, very thankful to them for that. And yeah. uh, it's so weird nice. riding on this, uh, these loose pegs. Feel like I'm riding on a tilt -a wheel. <laughs> Excuse the language. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so, Ryan, I, I don't want to leave. My flight's in two hours. I know, I don't want you to leave either, man. Sucks, okay. This bike is getting real dangerous with these loose pegs. Yeah, we, we, can, just, we can just stop up here and finish her off. All right. No need for any more breakage. We don't want to, we don't want to push our luck. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, man, it's uh, oh no, oh no. It was a pretty amazing trip, and uh, I think anybody that was on that trip will agree. And I really hope all you guys like the videos that are going to be coming. Yeah, I think there's going to be some good stuff. We we all uh, all worked hard to get some good shots for you, and and uh, just yeah, share the awesome experience we had, and also encourage anybody that rides a dual sport or a dirt bike and to come uh, to come adventure vlogging with us next year, Hell wherever yeah. we decide to meet up. Adventure vlogging, man. That's it's uh, uh, you know how some people ride to a meet. Adventure vlogging is uh, meeting to go ride, and it's a uh, this a different level. That's for sure. The distance people covered to come out there and make it happen. The uh, uh, you know, ride a map coming out from Tennessee, and Joe being willing to loan him his TT350, and then with uh, bike breakage. Dr. Dual Sport coming to the rescue. And, oh my God, yeah. I mean, Brett. that guy, you know, Brett hooking us up with trailing our, taking our trailer from camp, which was 10 miles on a 15, uh, 15 mile an hour washboard road every single day when he had to also drive another 40 minutes out of town just to get to where he was staying. Brett is the man. Yeah, Aries 0909, guys. That guy right there, you go, you go sub him up right now. That yeah. guy is, is awesome. And let's uh, not forget that these two Hawaiian guys traveled 6,000 yes. miles to get to Moab. Our <laughs> arms are so tired from <laughs> swimming. It's just ridiculous. The bike's oh, on the back and everything. I thought you flew. Oh, we don't know how to fly <laughs> yet. We're not that good. <laughs> but seriously, bro, thank you so much for the... Thank you so much yeah, dude, for the... You're welcome, man. Oh, I don't want to leave. I'm going to cry, I think so. so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting uh, clipped. <laughs> that was an... It, dude... I'm going to miss everybody. I'm going to miss the whole whole crew. But, as Arnold says, it's not a tumor. <laughs> no, no, no. He says, I'll be back. I'll be back. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> shit. Oh. Okay, man. Good <sighs> shit. Well, I guess let's get you to the airport. I guess it's time to go. Okay. All right. This is uh, Ministop and Nessa Productions signing off.